Okay guys, welcome back to the Ace and Ace channel. I'm your host Tommy, and welcome back to part 5 of my Titan Progress on Destiny 2. Welcome to the Ace and Ace Destiny 2 clan videos. And we're going to continue our Agarian Rises quest step from step 9. And it will later last up in part 4. We did the cold boot mission and went to speak to I'm sure for step 8, which is now give us step 9, we've got to complete the mission, and then better, and that's what we're going to do now. Try the spider, I think. Yeah, there we go. We have a spider to use, so we'll use that one now. We should press the menu button and press square to summon your spider, and it will spawn, and then you can just whiz around the map a lot quicker than having to run if you wish. Or well, you can walk or run, it's entirely your preference. So there's our quest step marker, that's now up here, so that's where we're heading, up there. Square to jump off, and press square to start the quest mission. And apologies for my phone, that's... Discord notifications going off. I can't, I can't reach Shao. Shao. Oh. If Navota gets to him first, we need to find another key and access that chamber fast. There's some old caches nearby. Let's start there. No key, but I'm detecting residual particles consistent with cache alloys. Press options. There were more chests here once. Oh, yeah, they must have been stolen by Fallen or Hive. There's a part of the trail leading to a nearby cave. Um, Sending coordinates now. Which we're going to go with that one because it's the highest one we've got. So that's now took us power level to 1157. And we can dismantle those for weapon parts in the future. And that's took us to 1169 by doing that. So we can dismantle that. 1189 my point the boots on and that's going to take a bit 1204 there we go I put in the one on but we haven't got any more gear so we can't put anything on just yet Put the sword on for that. Vanguard scouts report a fallen kitchen. Nice right for position. that. And the auto rifle for that, which is now took us to 1238. As our warlock character is 1334. Because that's now the highest rank, so our Titan has jumped up pretty fast by putting the new high gear that we've picked up. I do have some exotic weapon, 
gear in the vault which I can pick up from the tower later and it'll, it'll probably go a bit higher that now is it that so now we've got to follow the trail which is going back where we came from so not enough space so we'll move to make some space there we go and then we'll glide up where we need to be on our shadow and we'll go in here into the cave And it's in this loop chest now, so I'm guessing we're getting another key in here. A square. Still no key. Mm -hmm. I'm reading two other weapon, particle trails on my tracker. But it still not gives us a key. Because we are looking for a key. So, back out the cave. Rest some of me rock shadow. Check your weapons. I'm reading a cluster of high bioenergetics. Careful. I'm detecting a high density of fallen weapon signatures nearby. There's some encryption code on this data pad, but it's incomplete. If we find more, I could fake the authorization and act as a key myself. There's still one more cache on the tracker. We'll always pull it set to while we're here. We might get some loot from it. We got some gauntlets now, so we can actually do the upgrade on the gauntlets. So there we go, 1260. This might all those. So that's upgraded my equipment a bit higher. So we haven't got much to go on his power level. To go to 1300 power level on my Titan. So power level from now on during the videos isn't really going to be much of priority cover 
Got it. This has enough code fragments for me to generate a new authorization. I need to boost my signal for the key to register, though. I'm reading a concentration of energy in the body yards. Might be what we need. I've marked your tracker. This area is full of ionized superconductor energy. It must have dispersed when we activated the array. I can use this to amplify my signal. Let's collect the charges. I still can't reach Shaw. We need to hurry. Yeah, always a marker one where I regularly on my warlock. This challenge. This quest step. You gotta get all these arc energy and get even my character to jump up there. I'm always a problem. And that's the one that's the problem. That one there. I'm getting the jump speed or the ability on that to get that. That's the problem we have. Here we go, starting recursive analysis. Thread complete. I am now authorized. Let's hurry. So now, oh, quite that one's cash while we're here. Now we should be able to go straight through, yeah we can, and go straight in the building now. Get rid of the apocalypse. Do a guard in this area. Um, go through here. You can shoot that, otherwise that will trap you when you go in, but you can shoot that by shooting directly at it. And then now we've got access to the door. This 
This place is brimming with hive magic. That explains why transmats were blocked. Look at that. We spy is restricted, so in other words, we're in an area where we must not die. Is the correct terminology on that? Nabota, eyes up, guardian. Apologies for my battery being low on the pad. I got me right Whoa, 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 whoa. Yep, I wiped. Tried not to there, but I got uh, mass ganged upon, unfortunately. So I'm going to try that again. This time I haven't got the ability, so I can't uh, super arc them. Nabota, eyes up, guardian. Well, most of the that one, man.
Navota's gone. Wherever she went, I can't detect her anymore. But I've got a lock on Shaw's ghost. So we're down underneath there. Let here. me help him. There you go. Shaw, are you Rescue all right? Shaw. What? What are you doing here? We couldn't let you do this alone. Navota? She's still alive. Somewhere. We did enough to force her to retreat. You... fought her off? All right, then. I'm... sorry I left you behind. After Cass and Maeve, I was just afraid to lose anyone else. So were we. That's why we followed you. Nobody likes to be sidelined. I'm glad you were here. I owe you. The prize is yours. Superconductor is over there. Grab it and meet back at camp. For real this time. So take the superconductor. What we came for. There's the superconductor. Let's finish the job. I can feel the arc light coursing through this. No wonder the Vanguard want to make a weapon with it. Let's head back to camp and then the last city. Home. We'll speak to Sean now and give his next quest step, and then that will be the end of this What's part as well. Sean Ham is a Vanguard operative, if you didn't know. Hey. Thanks for the assist. Again. Wish you stumbled in the day earlier. Might have gone differently. Maybe Cass and Maeve. I I'm just glad the light chose you. I've got new orders to stick around and scout Novota's brood. Maybe I'll find some other new lights to shepherd along. As for you, it's time you meet Commander Zavala. He leads Guardian Ops from the last city. I've told him you'll be arriving soon with a superconductor, so take care of that thing. No dents or scratches. Zavala's a great leader and a good person. Learn from him. And don't be a stranger. Guardians are stronger together, right? So we require the ship. And we'll travel to the tower. Okay, so we've got a bit more to do before we log off. We'll have to go to the tower. Okay. Travel to the tower. What do you say? So Time for some shock and awe. Middle button. Spin the map up. Use your cursor up to destinations. And then press select where the marker is tracked where we need to go. And we need to go to the last city. And we Never understood how Titans move so fast in that armor.
the last survivors of humanity's collapse call the city home. This is why I brought you back. To defend them. And to reclaim our lost worlds. We're here. The Traveler. The last city. Welcome home. That's another cinematic played. Welcome to the tower and the last safe city of humanity. I've been here many times over the years. So I speak to I'm glad you finally get to see tower. to see why we're here and what we need to protect. Let's start by registering your jump ship. Ty. Yep, yep, yep. Let's talk. Even when it says she stands up from this and disassembles Pharaoh engine, she wipes the grief off her hands with a dirty towel. You must be Charles Powell. He told me you were coming, said to take it easy on you. She offers you a casual smile. Name's Harvey. I run a hangar here in the tower. If you need anything relating to ships, sparrows, or anything of the kind of the engine, you come to me. I'll take care of the bird here while you get the lay of the land. I think the valor was expected you up in the courtyard. You take care now, she says, with a wave as she grabs a wrench and dives back into her work. Press X to accept. I'm going to speak Thanks, to the Guardian. Nice, isn't it? It's good to have somewhere that feels like home. For me, this is it. Okay, next up is tower security. We've had an increase in Guardians sneaking in contraband since a fellow called the Drifter arrived. So Vanguard Command instituted a check for first-timers. Looks like the superconductor's Golden Age tech triggered some warnings. I'm clearing it with security. Commander Zavala would like to meet you in person. I'll lead you to him. Zavala leads the entire Vanguard, the group that supports all Guardian operations. Lately, he spends more time commanding troops than fighting on the front lines. But he placed some of the first stones in the wall we're standing on. Zavala thinks every life in the city is his responsibility. Even a guardian has trouble bearing that kind of weight. He's going to need your help. You're a titan. You'll be able to help him shoulder that burden. Up there in the sky? That's the Traveler. It's where I came from. Where the light you wield came from. Ah, oh, excuse me. The one that saved Shaw. Thank you for that. Your ghost has been looking for you for a long time. I'm glad he finally found you. And now you found the light. The Traveler entrusted us with this power so that we may protect our people from the forces that threaten our existence. You've carried out that duty from your first steps in the Cosmodrome. I don't take Shaw's recommendation lightly. But you have much to learn, and the conflict with the darkness is unyielding. We will analyze the superconductor you recovered. In the meanwhile, I've left you something in my office. Use it well. The battle welcomes you to a new home, last city. He encourages you to continue with meeting the residents of the tower and informs you that there was a gift waiting for you in his office. Press X to accept. And on to the next quest. So we'll pick up his gift. Zavala so doesn't usually model. talk that much. You should take that as a compliment. So. I've marked his office on your tracker. Careful not to break anything in there, and don't touch his music. Go to the don't lift. Whoa. Okay. We we'll just jump down there. I should have been there for me to drop down. I just dropped down like a stack of spubs there. But okay. 
This is a Vanguard service weapon, but it's from Zavala's personal collection. Shaw must have talked you up quite a bit, or maybe Zavala saw something in you. Where to next? Oh, you should head to the bazaar. That's where we'll find Ikora. Uh, you're out, out, out to the email, so we've got a few of you, so we need to go speak to Ikura. So we'll have to go bubble if you're right. When it comes back down, there we go. Which I'll also explain something while we're down here as well. When you come down in this bit, you will have eventually Ada 1, you'll have the Drifter for the Gambit, Ikora Ray is the and you Vanguard. also, if she you create your own clan, you create I your own clan, you create your own clan, you create your own clan, you development, enemy reconnaissance and internal affairs, and, and she's a sight nice. to see in the Crucible. Where you create your own clan, um, like we are the aces and eights, you will come to here. Symbols inspire people. All for me, she's a clan leader, which unfortunately at the moment she hasn't got anything for me because um, my progress hasn't transferred over yet because I haven't officially set up, fully set up my character yet, so. That link to the. I can spare a minute or two. Other side has not approached yet, so I square and I can't. Can teach me? Welcome home, Gabby. I heard the journey to the last city was an eventful one. And Goddess says she gazes at the traveller. It may not feel like it now, but the tribulations you faced were by facing. She turns to address you in a stare. He's piercing. A guardian's path is one of hardship and peril. The traveller's gifts paved the way, but the road is still a hard one to walk. But you need not walk it alone. The vanguard is here for you, as are your fellow guardians in the last city. She hands you a small, lacquered box. Accept help where you can find it, guardian. Our light shines brighter when we're together. And you've just... I've got a new ghost shell. So now I can upgrade my ghost. So, Come back speaking nice. of Drifter, that's where we're going next. Always nice to see Ikora. While we're over here, we should check in with the Drifter. You may be wondering who leads the Hunters. See, we lost Kate Six, our Hunter Vanguard, a while back. Killed by a man named Uldren Solom. It was a difficult time. Now no Hunter wants to take his place. What's up, hero? You look like you use a friend, Drifter says with a smirk. Back from the grave with almighty powers just to win, just to wind up this uppy place. Salute in commander, stick up his butt. Sounds like a bad beat. A coin appears in Drifter's hand. He casually rolls it across his knuckles. I could use a friend too. You know, and what you mean to understand is old Drifter always takes care of his friends. His smile stretches ear to ear. It tore a hive up the back on old Russia. Tell you what, since you like tussing with the knights, you can have this sword. No charge, of course, for a friend. Just swing back when you're tired of being Zavala's Evan Runner, and we'll talk business. That picks up a sword. And now I'm going to speak to Lob Shax, who builds the Crucible. See, the thing about Drifter is, he's unique. Let's leave it at that. I 
know a hunter who brings these in. They're not cheap. Oh, and no tour of the tower would be complete without meeting Lord Shax. Shax is in charge of live fire drills and general combat training for Guardians. It all happens in the Crucible, where Shax oversees battles of light versus light. Did you show the darkness what light can do? Ah, sure hands save your lives, Lord Shax says. Each tower is overused and being proudly in front of a waving crucible flag at the Dormy's workspace. You may have survived the cost of Drum Guardian. But your steel is not yet tempered. He claps his hands together. When you're free and ready for a real test, join the fellow guardians in the crucible. Only pitching yourself against other light bearers can you truly forge yourself into a weapon you're meant to be. And pick up the triumph banner. And then I'm going to speak There's to Banshee. Isn't Shaq something? When he's not yelling, he plays dodgeball with the children of the city. He, uh, yells during that, too. Anyway, Zavala's asking us to visit the gunsmith next. His name is Banshee44, our resident firearms expert. Banshee stands at counter, not particularly expecting him face weapon. Oh, hey, yo, you here, he says gruffly. Don't think I've seen you around before, then again, not good faces. He trails off his attention back to some detail in the rifle in his hands. He regards you carefully for a moment. Oh, that's right, Commander told me you were coming. Asked me to get you set up. Got it on a note right here. Here takes this, it's solid. His eyes look past you for the moment before snapping back. Oh, hey, wait, we spoke already, right? Right, stay safe. Press X to acquire the gun. We just picked up. Speak with Master Station, Rahul, sir. which is a cryptarch. Last stop is Master Rahul, the Tower Cryptarch. That's short for Crypto Archaeologist. Well, Titan, well, let's see what we have here. Greetings, Gary and Master Rahul says his attention does not shift from the video pad in his hand. As the Tower's resident cryptarch archaeologist, I am either at your service. His tone is dry and flat, and he does not look at you. Bring me any engrams you find, and I will decrypt their matter into a into usable state, and hopefully learn something interesting in the process. That's X. And I'm going back to Zavala. That about wraps it up. There are still people in the tower to meet, but you can do that at your own pace. Zavala sent me a message saying he has a mission ready for you. Check in with him if that sounds interesting, or we can just explore. In any case, I'm with you till the end. You take the lead. Good. You're back. I see you fish around. These people are invaluable resources for your journey as a guardian. You will do well to remember that you will take your as you take your next steps. Speaking of which, I have a first assignment. Shaw has successfully tracked down the voter in the Cosmodrome. I am authorizing a strike op operation to eliminate her, and I want you to arm it. The voter is responsible for the death of a fellow Gavians, of death of, fellow, of two fellow Gavians. We cannot allow her to call any more. From our ranks, I am trusting you and Shaw to get the job done. Good luck, Gavian. Press X. There we go. So, let's go to our quest board. So there we have it. Um, we will continue the final part of our Guardian Rises. In part six, we will we will do the disgraced. Accessing the Vanguard playlist screen uh, next time. So we've actually gone further than I expected to do in this. So I have been your host, Tommy. Thank you for watching the Aces and Eights Clan video and the Aces and Eights Clan. We'll see you all in the next Aces and Eights Clan video next time, guys. Bye for now.